Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing? So I'm back with an inspired look, and it's inspired by Valentine's Day. So I thought I'd go ahead and show you what I did. I went ahead and started with the usual, the glow oil with the SPF of 50, and this is by Supergoop. And then as far as what I went ahead and did for my base today, um, I went ahead and used the Glow Serum uh, by Hard Candy. And so this is a glowy primer. And then I did use a True Match by L'Oreal in C1. And this is my winter shade for when I don't have any more color left. And, and I also use the ColourPop Pretty Fresh as well as far as my concealer. And I was just feeling really like a very pink maroon kind of look today. So pink, red, maroon, the whole thing. So I did go ahead and use the Light Radiant or Light Rosy Radiant by um, MAC for my bronzer. It's one of my favorites. And let's see. I also did go ahead and use um, Pat McGrath and this. I think it's part of the Bridgerton collection, um, and this is, let's see, I think it goes like that, and then I did go ahead and use this blush, and I've had quite a morning of it. So far, I have managed to um, spill quite a few things. I spilled this, and it didn't break at all, and I'm very grateful for that. And then, as far as what else I used, I um, did go ahead and use the JD Glow Highlighter. This one's in Maryland, and this one will give you a glow to the next galaxy because it is a very glow. It's one of my glowiest highlighters ever. And let's see, what else did I do? I used the Wet n Wild Holiday Foxtrot. This is a Jolly Berry Jumper. I think these ran like somewhere between 5 and $8. And this one I just thought would be really good for, um, for Valentine's Day, having this many pinks and maroons. And actually today, I went ahead and used this in the crease, which is basically a bronze. I went ahead and used this on the lid. And then the other casualty from today was my Luxie eyeshadow in hot. And it went, it spilled. And yeah, it's pretty much gone. But that's okay. I put it on the lid. And um, I'll put it back in the C palette and be pretty careful with it. But yeah, it's kind of sad. So again, what I did was I put this in the crease. I put this on the lid. I put the Loxy Shadow and Hot on or over the pink on the lid. Um, I did use a little bit of the glitter right on the brow bone and some of the white. I went from here. To about here on that. Um, did use the usual suspects on the rest of it, which is going to be the Essence Thick and Wow. And then um, the Maybelline Sky High Pack, which I'm really liking because I love the Sky High mascara. And so this the pack that you can get over at Walmart includes the primer and the mascara, so it gives you a lot a lot for your money. I think it's like $16, $17. And then um, the this is an M-Ride eyeliner that I used as well. This is how the look came out. So yeah, I went for as sparkly and as shiny as I could. As far as what I have on the lips today, um, I did use the ColourPop and this was the one in their Lippy Pencil and Dazed, and let me see if I can find it here. Yeah. When things sort of spilled, I kind of, yeah, here it is. So here's Dazed, and then I did go ahead and put some of the Hard Candy, and this is my type. This is one of their plumping glosses on top. We'll go ahead and add a little bit more. It's a cooling plumper, so it doesn't, it's not one of the hot ones like the jalapeno peppers. This is a nice cooling one, and it works pretty well. I kind of like it, so, yeah, 
that's what I had there. It turned out a little bit darker, but I kind of like it. So, um, that's kind of the look. Probably uh, you could go ahead and switch out just about any really glittery um, because I, any glittery shade for the Loxy would probably work. And um, again, these, I think they're still over at Ulta. Um, I'm pretty sure you can still order these. And if you're looking for something that's not that expensive, but it will give you a cute look, a cute pink look, this is definitely a palette that'll do it. And um, you can also, yeah, it's uh, it's a good one for this time of year, having the bronze and the burgundy pink kind of thing in there. Um, the only other thing I don't think I've mentioned is the Physician's Formula, the Butter Glow. And again, I did repurchase this. I've been really enjoying it. And I think that's probably the whole look. I hope that you have a great day, and I'll see you later. Bye.